okay so in the last video we set up our um, chat class and we're able to connect to our chat application server and send messages um, from clients to the server and as you can see they're being echoed in the um, command line here so in this video let's see how we can implement the methods in this chat class here so the first thing that we need to do is let's um, instantiate and set the um, value for this client's property here so anytime a client connects we want to um, add that to the list of clients so let's say this clients um, equals to um, new SPL object so SPL object is a PHP um, class that's used for um, storing um, basically key value objects okay it's very good at that so um, we're gonna use that and next let's um, implement the on open um, function here so um, anytime a client connects we're going to store that in the clients um, property here of this class so this client uh, we're going to attach that connection to um, that um, connections list here which is clients so um, since we're being passed the connection um, in the parameters here we just say con c o n n okay so and after that let's just notify the server um, let's go and print out a message in the server command line that a new client has connected so let's say new connection and then um, we're going to list out the connection resource id so because each connection um, has an id so let's just say con and let's say resource id okay and then we just do a backslash n okay so next um let's implement what happens when a message is sent okay so what we need to do is we just need to um for each um through all the clients um that are currently connected um in the server and send a message to all of them so for each this clients as client um, what we want to do is we want to say uh, if the current client that is the sender of this message is not equal to um, the client that we're currently looping through send a message to that client okay so let's say if um, client is not equal to I was just use a double equal to to make sure that I am is um, strict it's not equal to um, whoever the message is from so whoever send the message is the one that's being passed here and then we're looping over all clients okay so if the, they are not the same now we can do client has sent okay and then what we want to send we want to send message msg okay so next let's implement the on close um, function here so basically what what happens there is that anytime a client um, disconnects and um, this function will be called with that client's connection so all we need to do is just say this clients so remember that's the list of clients and then um, we add clients to that list by using attach but we remove clients from that list by using detach okay and what we want to detach we want to detach that current connection which is stored in con and then um, all we need to do is say is echo um, connection with ID as um, disconnected so let's say connection and then um, what do we want to um, display is the connection IDs um, which um, lives in resource ID and then um, as disconnected and let's do a backslash n uh, for new line and finally let's implement the on error function here uh, all we need to do is echo and error has occurred and um, let's get a message for that error so um, let's just do a curly brace here so that we can um, output that inside of this string so we do e get message is a method in the um, exception class that um, gives you the message um, for that current error okay so next what we need to do is just say can and then close just close the connection okay so um, let's just test this out to make sure that um, everything's working fine so I'll just close this here um, the PHP server I'll just quit it as you can see connection closed by a um, foreign host in telnet that's not coming up from our server but let's um, just quickly load up the server and we're having some errors um, it says on line 26 in chat so let's see what that is probably some syntax error um, for each it should be a four uh, let's just try to load that up again so um yeah so our server is running now let's connect through telnet and um, it says new connection and it gave us the resource id here so um let's just send a message to the server let's say hello 
new message and then um press enter and basically what's happening is that um since we changed the logic um anytime message is sent last time what happened was we are doing an echo like this we said echo and then we echo a message that's why um you were seeing the message on the um command line here but this time we're saying that anytime a message is sent by one client show it in another client okay so we'll connect um using another client so i'll connect here now when i do hello message um like i did before it will not show up on the server console here but instead it will show up um on the other clients which are connected okay and notice that when the new client has connected again any time new client connects um it just is new connection with the id of that client so in here let's just say hello users as you, you're gonna see that on this other console here so i press enter as you can see hello users so let's say hi how are you all and um, as you can see it is showing up over here okay so um let's just close one of these client connections and um, you should see that it says that a client has disconnected on the server here so i'll just um quickly close that client and it says escape character is um this here so you do and the up key and uh, closing bracket and i press enter how do you close this i'll just um close that manually like this and as you can see it says connection has disconnected okay so um so yeah so that's it guys for this video and um, i thank you for watching and as usual uh, please rate comment and um, subscribe and if this video was helpful um Please share it with your friends so they may benefit as well from it. And um, thanks, thanks for watching for now. I'll see you soon in the next video. Cheers. Bye-bye.